Good morning everybody. Welcome to this week's early morning walk in the park where we take three minutes to answer your commonly asked questions about the roofing repair process, the roofing replacement process, the insurance claim process, or whatever other questions you might have. This week we're going to answer a commonly asked question that we get about who do I pay my deductible to? So this issue frequently confuses people because the insurance company, if you have a replacement cost value policy, the insurance company is holding back money called the depreciation amount. So that's the amount that they have decided that your roof has depreciated since it was installed and they hold that money back. Again, that's on a replacement cost value policy, which we'll explain in a future episode. So they hold that money back, but then they're also uh, keeping out of the claim your deductible amount. So that means, for example, if you have a claim that's $10,000 and the depreciation amount is $4,000 and you have a $1,000 deductible, they're going to hold back $4,000. They're going to deduct $1,000 because that's your deductible. And so then you're going to get a check for $5,000, your first check. Okay, Remember that that's your first check because you're going to get another one. When the job is all done and your contractor sends in an invoice to the insurance company saying that he's charging uh, their customer $10,000, they're going to release that $4,000 depreciation, but they're not ever going to release the deductible. Because remember, you as a homeowner, you as the insured, have a share in the cost of the repair or the replacement of your deductible, $1,000. Well, so the reason people get confused is because they think, well, I already paid the deductible to the insurance company, right? Or do I have to send them a check for $1,000? No, you don't send them a check because they held that or they just took that out of the claim. They did not pay that to you. So um, your share in the claim is your $1,000 deductible. So do you pay it to the insurance company? No, because that's no part of the claim. Do you pay it to the contractor? Yes, but don't let yourself get confused because some people say, well, I already paid it to the insurance company because they didn't give it to me. And so if I pay it to the contractor, then I'm paying it twice. Well, you're not, you're not really. Um, it, it does seem like it, but you're really not. Remember, uh, the deductible is your share of the amount of the claim. So uh, again, in that example, it's a $10,000 claim. You have a skin in the game of $1,000. Your insurance company expects you to pay that. And so that's how that works. So don't get confused. The deductible payment has to be paid to the contractor. It's not paid to the insurance company. So hopefully that helps answer your question about who you pay your deductible to. And so if you've got any further questions, you can give us a call at Homestead Roofing uh, right here. We'll make room for that 719-433-6991 you can also visit our website contact us through there we've got lots of tips and information on the website homesteadroofingcolorado.com right down there otherwise we'll see you next week on our early morning walk through homestead ranch regional park until then i'm tracy bookman with homestead roofing